Welcome back everyone, today we have the unboxing of the Hattles Vintage Racing Club basic themed case. Starting with Lamborghini Miura, released in 2019 as an ID casting, some of you might still remember the ID series, it was an interesting concept. I do own two versions of it, although I wish I could have found the Super Treasure Hunt. Interesting design on the cards with a part of the racetrack featuring each race car. It looks like a year full of cool basic series considering how it started. Next is the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL. Released in 2020, we had this Mercedes on the channel before and we also remember the RLC release, the IWC Special Edition. It has a few interesting mainline releases and again, one that has also been a super treasure hunt. I am a white car collector so this is one that I enjoy seeing, especially with the white rims, 5 star spoke that are new in the Hatless lineup. Unfortunately, we only get one in the case and it's probably going to be a hard one to find on the pegs. Next is the 1971 Porsche 911. Released in 2018, we already have a few versions of this 911 and we did talk about it in the previous video with the Porsche set. I am glad I have a few versions of it as it is a nice model, even though Hatlus did make versions that are almost identical. We are used to repeats, but that usually happens in the premium series. It is looking great with the green colors and the white base, the rims are the same as the previous release from the Porsche basic set that we had on the channel last week. We can never say no to a cool Porsche diecast model. Next is the BMW 2002. Released in 2012, being the oldest casting in today's set with some very cool releases along the way. The case has 3 of them and your case might be different cause, as you can see, you don't have 2 full sets but randomized. If you get a different layout in the case, please let us know in the comments. Most of its releases are in the main lines, but we have some interesting premium releases as well. The liveries chosen look great on the white colors and the wheels fit the casting. We have the best Italian and German car brands so far, I wonder what can we end the set with? Last in the case, the 1955 Corvette. Also released in 2012, this Corvette is a very interesting convertible, having premium releases that are very hard to find these days. They are all vintage with the exception of the BMW, and the set also has a chase. One that we didn't get in this case, the 1967 Camaro. It can already be found on eBay, but in my opinion it does not worth the high price asked, even though it's harder to find than all other cars in the case. What might not be so hard to find are these next sets, and you can check their case unboxings by clicking on these videos. Thank you for watching, and have fun watching the next video.